I am so happy. My current emotion is joy. I feel like saying the word woo. Woo hoo. That's because today is International Feel Sorry for Yourself Day. Yay. It's my favorite day of the year. I'd like to say thank you to all of my viewers all around the world who have sent me their sob stories. Like Lou, who recently joined the military, only to have the army dentist pull out all her wisdom teeth. Jip in the Netherlands recently had an emergency appendectomy, and nobody visited him in the hospital. Ingrid has multiple sclerosis, sleep apnea, and takes chemotherapy that turns urine radioactive green. Thanks, Ingrid. Also, special thanks to Ashley, who recently sent me these pictures of her cat Max being euthanized. Look at this photo where he's glazed over with death, before his cold, cold corpse is lowered into the ground and buried forever. These are really difficult situations, and anyone would have the right to feel bad for themselves. But I think the person we should really feel sorry for here is me. I'm the one who has to read these emails. Well, last time on Cute with Chris, I asked you to vote on who is cuter. Nibbler the ferret, Lucy the dog who wears glasses, or Frida the lazy wiener dog. Over 4.39 million people wasted their lives voting, and the winner is Lucy the dog who wears glasses. You know, I'm gonna go out on a limb here, Lucy, and say I don't think you really need those glasses. I think you're faking it. I think this whole glasses thing was just to get a sympathy vote. Oh, that poor dog. Oh, she can't see. She has impaired vision. I'm gonna vote for her. Hey, way to make people feel sorry for you. And now it's time for Pets Who Murder. Today on Pets Who Murder, we meet Tuesday the cat. She lives with Jeffrey in New York. Jeffrey has type 2 diabetes and needs to be hooked up to an insulin pump. Once, when Jeffrey was asleep, Tuesday chewed through the tubes on his machine and all his insulin drained out onto the couch and he nearly fell into a coma. I don't know about you, kitty cat, but where I come from, we call that... Murder. Tuesday, the cat who attempted murder, sent in by Jeffrey in New York. A viewer pets now. Time for viewer pets. Today's viewer pet is Bella from Canada. I'm also gonna show you Gwen Stefani, sent in by Chelsea in Colorado, and Brain, the recently born bird, sent in by Kevin. Oh, poor little me, I've got no feathers. I look like an eraser, I'm ugly. No! Shoot down. Well, listen everybody, it has been such a pleasure to share International Feel Sorry For Yourself Day with you. It's the one day where you can act like the sucky little bitch you are. Remember, on the other 364 days of the year, never share negative feelings, because that would make you human. It's important to keep your emotions deep inside where they can eat away at your soul. Focus on the things you're really good at. Unless, of course, you're really good at feeling sorry for yourself. Who is cuter? This Chihuahua, Gwen Stefani. Tuesday, the murder cat, or Brain, the recently born bird. Oh. I've got no feathers, vote for me. Bullshit. Cast your vote by clicking on the link at cutewithchris.com and we'll see you next time on Cute with Chris. My current emotion is joy.